Hey everyone, welcome back. So December is right around the corner and that means that it's time of our list of top games to look out for for the month of December. Now, traditionally, December isn't a big month in gaming because normally there's no AAA releases because it's so close to Christmas. However, that doesn't mean that there's no games releasing and contrary to usual, I normally only focus on physical release games but if you're into the genre, there's a couple of games you're really not going to want to miss this month, even though they're digital-only releases. I'm also going to be switching up the format a little bit on this video series. And if any of you have seen the previous videos and are watching this one, I would really like you to leave in the comments down below which of the two formats you prefer. Basically, what's going to change this month, as you're going to see, I'm going to talk a little bit less about each game, only giving the big details about them, since this isn't a review, it's really just what games we should be on the lookout for and I'm going to let the trailers end where you get a little bit of the sound and let the trailers talk for themselves a little more. I think it'll be better overall but I'd really appreciate your comments so please let me like let me know down below which one of the two formats you prefer. So first on our list releasing on December 3rd we have Saga Scarlet Grace Ambitions, a JRPG that was originally released for the PlayStation Vita in 2016. It was later ported for Japan in 2018 to the Switch, and now this year we're getting a release in the West. Now this is a beautiful classic styled JRPG with turn-based combat. And this version has enhanced graphics, new character voiceovers, new skills, and even additional storyline. So second on our list, we have Star Ocean First Departure R releasing on December 5th. Now Star Ocean is a, another classic JRPG series, but this one is known for blending basically sci-fi with fantasy in its storyline. Now this game is even older, it was originally released for the Super Famicom back in 1996. It was remade for the PSP in 2007 and now we're getting a full HD remaster with new graphics and additional features for the Nintendo Switch. So the legend was true all along. Maybe that's the secret. For us, the real adventure begins now. Next on our list, we have our first physical release for December. On December 6th, Assassin's Creed The Rebel Collection, which groups together Assassin's Creed Black Flag and Assassin's Creed Rogue. So in one, you're going to be the most feared pirate in the Caribbean, and in the other, you're going to be the ultimate assassin hunter. Both games have great gameplay, and if you're fans of the series, you're not gonna wanna miss this collection. including Freedom Cry. Assassins. Now last on our list is the game I'm most waiting for for the month of December and that will be Shovel Knight the Treasure Trove Pack. It's f Shovel Knight is finally getting that physical release and if everything lines up well it should be on December 10th along with the last portion of DLC. And this pack will basically be grouping the main game together along with all the DLC content released over the last two years. For those who don't know, Shovel Knight is a great pixel art award winning franchise and I've been waiting for this collection for a long long time.
So that was our list of top games for the month of December. So I hope you guys liked this video, so please don't forget to hit that like button if you did. If you didn't, please let me know down in the comments down below what you didn't like. And also for those following the series, please let me know which one of the two formats you prefer. Do you rather I talk over the whole trailers, give a little more details on each game, or just give the big lines like I did today and let the trailers speak for themselves. So as usual, please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I hope I'll see you guys in my next video.